Hello, 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 everyone. This is your Hall of Famer, Director, Ambassador Marlon Green, synchronizing this raggedy universe, how they leaving it. Uh, today, I want to talk about why be mad at me when you're the problem. Because I ruined Mother's Day for you all yesterday, and I'm not apologizing. You know why? Because y'all destroyed way more for me than I destroyed for you. And look, guess what? I'm going to continue to destroy it and get a, until I get my proper due. And also, I wanted to say, American women are garbage. They'll take sides with the wrong guy, and they'll hurt you, and they would never say you're sorry. I have a mom that destroyed my car. I have moms that's in billing as options, that's uh, sending me bills that I don't deserve. I got moms in the court lying on me. I got moms everywhere else stopping my progress. And let me tell you something. All of these groups, I'm telling you, that's not that's no good for you. Don't ever stick with a group over me because you know why? Because these groups do too much dirt. And they don't never say they sorry. I have these fraternities and shit that be jumping in my way. I got my daughter bullshit and her ex mom. I got society bullshit. All of y'all are the same. And uh, until you prove different, you're going to be treated different. Ice Cube call you bitches. Dr. Dre call you bitches. A lot of these rappers call y'all bitches because y'all act like bitches. Now, it's not all of y'all fault, and it's some of the men fault too, but it's mostly y'all fault at 15 to 1. You're very selfish, you're very conceited, and even if you hurt somebody, you're not going to say you're sorry. So instead of y'all attacking us all the time, and we not saying nothing, I'm going to bring it to you, because America owes me more than you're willing to admit. The American woman owes me more than you're willing to admit. And guess what? Uh, I, I, the, the, the TV and radio stations are hating on me, right? And they want to play less accomplice, right? So I made a complaint to the Federal Trade Commission about this bullshit, about intellectual and intercultural property. Because if white folks is going to buy our culture and kick us out our own culture then i have a problem with that and we're going to do administrative fight and this is why my federal court cases get thrown back in the court after being thrown out you know why because it shouldn't have never been thrown out a lot of y'all bitches are degenerates and you're going to blame the man no matter what you don't deserve a happy mother's day you know who deserves a happy mother's day Happy Mother's Day to Africa. You know why? Because Africa never did anything to anyone. And you all will give props to Michelle Obama. And you all will give props to Hillary Clinton. And you all will give props to Oprah Winfrey. And she's not even a mother. And then y'all talk all over guys. You can't really talk to them. That's how I know something's wrong with you all. And if you can't stick to the subject in the face of intelligence, you're going to give yourself away. And guess what? Y'all not intelligence. This is why I don't date Americans. Because they'll hurt you and they'll look over you and they'll blame you for the problem. And it's really them. All of these things that these women have done to me, they have said they're sorry. Most of the men in my life have apologized or said they're sorry. And I told you, y'all are the ones that sent me to federal prison and they made me a shot caller. I'm not going to change, motherfucker. Y'all should change your ways. You should change your ways more than me. And this is why I destroyed your Mother's Day. Because you're too busy getting rewarded for terrible behavior. Happy Mother's Day to Africa instead of Happy Mother's Day to African Americans. Because they'll owe you money, they'll damage your property, they'll give you the cold shoulder, they'll talk shit about you, but they could never tell you in your face. They couldn't have a decent conversation. They don't go to counseling. 
they don't apologize. All they do is complain. 20 years later, they take all of your shit from lying about a relationship. And Russell Simmons' uh, case is an example. This goes back 44 years. That has to be the record. And if y'all were worth anything, y'all would be helping people instead of ganging up, tearing them down at 15 to 1. Y'all are pathetic, pathetic.